future, Wakanda has become an interstellar superpower. Black Panther, Shuri, and other outstanding Wakandans from Royal Council of Wakanda, which works to integrate advanced technology into practice of their Asian. What's that? The Dormilaje armor right there? That shit look cold with the spears. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. My bad, I didn't want to talk in between, but yeah, y'all know I'm here. But yeah, now that look cool though. Honestly, hopefully we can see more of that or something like that. That's dope though. It look cool. Society's spiritual creed. The council led the construction of Wakanda Science Academy and pursuit of cutting-edge research. Including interdimensional travel and the use of coronium. One of its most important achievements is the invention of vibranium coronium. As a futuristic interstellar city of the intergalactic empire of Wakanda, the highly developed burning T'Challa has a unique urban landscape featuring high-density vibranium skyscrapers combined with traditional African tribal architectural styles, presenting the bold, distinctive imagination of Afrofuturism. The totemism and religious beliefs of old, never-left Wakanda statues of bast. The Black Panther goddess can be seen all throughout the city in a variety of forms, ranging from vibranium statues to holographic projections. This bustling space. See, I didn't want to pause right here, but the the spread over there with the food looks cool. I mean, the room looks nice. The room does look nice. I don't know if we're going to be fighting here or not, but it looks cool. But the spread of food, y'all gonna learn now. I'm a foodie, foodie type of guy. The, we need more food over here. I ain't gonna lie to you. But it's probably gonna be falling on the floor and everything, so whatever. Transport is Wakanda's most important transportation hub. Whether it's routing flights to nearby planets or long distance flights of multiple passes to the far ends of nearby galaxies, all manner of flights will depart from here. Wakanda is a powerful country with frequent economic and trade activities, and as such, it sees a steady stream of starships docking and departing. Its spaceport has different exit ports planned to suit the various purposes and sizes of visiting starships. Passengers on civilian starships must check in and board at the airport. Players will be able to visit the lounge, where the passengers relax while waiting to board. The Imperial Institute of Science is the technology. In terms of map design, I mean, I like the the design of it. Honestly, I'm not gonna lie to you. I like it, really. I need obviously we won't have to fail how it plays in game, obviously. But I mean, just the design of it alone, I like it. I like it. I fuck with. It. Technological and cultural center of Wakanda, where scientists led by Shuri are conducting research and samples of coronium combined with vibranium. Their ultimate pursuit is the construction of a time machine, which draws many heroes wishing to resolve the time stream entanglement. This is the core area of the entire college. I'm not, not gonna lie, this high ground right here look by is it looks crazy. It looks like it's gonna be crazy. If you're not nice at fighting up high ground, you might get bodied right here. This alone, if you have a good team, you're gonna control this entire area. I, again, I don't know why I'm bringing this up, but you know what I'm saying. Just letting y'all know. It's, it's gonna be great. Village where you can see instruments and decorations full of technological atmosphere. Shuri, ever the devoted researcher, has a temporary residence next to the laboratory, complete with an African-style bed so that she can rest. A necessity when she becomes so immersed. We're getting a nice sneak peek of what she gonna look like right here. Look at that. Oh my god. We trying to trying to get a sneak peek. Hold on. Slow. All right. I mean, she look like she gonna be basic. You know what I'm saying? She like she gonna have a nice hairstyle and everything. Nah, she look nah, nah. She look like she gonna be fire. Mhm. Mm nah, nah, nah. Definitely is, y'all. Oh, yeah. She gonna be on the slender side if y'all know what I'm saying. Like she gonna be yeah. She gonna be slender. She gonna be slender. Definitely slender. Yeah. Mhm. Mm Let's we'll see how she looks. In game though, of course, of course. First in her research that she forgets to eat and sleep. <music> Wakanda.
Wakanda's skilled warriors, despite technology's incredible advancement. Two things. This is quite interesting. One, this is from the movie, but not the actual location, but the waterfall, obviously. And the statues are moving. That's quite interesting. That's a nice little, little design right there. I like that. That's dope. That's dope. The statues moving, but they don't attack, which is good because that'd be some bullshit. But no, it's, it's dope. They're doing good. They're doing good. Have not forsaken the pursuit of physical strength, instead, adhering to high intensity training regimens. The intergalactic empire of Wakanda rebuilt the warrior force to remind everyone to never forget the nation's tradition of duels. Even in a high-tech society, the Wakanda's shared spirit and ideas passed down since ancient times would not be abandoned. This natural cave, decorated with traditional patterns, totems, ornaments, and words in traditional Wakanda tribal style, is where warriors rest and prepare for their upcoming duels. IGN first will release more new information about Marvel Rivals in November, so stay tuned.